OK. Um, in this last example, uh, the main important thing, guys, when we did these, what we talked about was using the rules of exponents, Marissa. And what the rules of exponents, what they applied, if you guys remember one of them with, it doesn't matter if it's a rational exponent or not. One of the rules of exponents that we talked about was what we call the power to quotient rule. And what the power to quotient rule tells us is if you have a quotient raised to a power, that power gets applied to both the numerator and the denominator. So basically, I can rewrite this as x to the negative 10th raised to the 2 fifths over x to the fifth raised to the 2 fifths. Now that we have simplified this, we can now use the power rule, which if you guys remember, the power rule states if you have an exponent raised to a power, you now multiply your powers. So I can re pretty much rewrite my whole numbers as fractions because I multiply numerator times numerator, numerator, denominator times denominator. Does that make sense to you? Yes, sir. OK. So therefore, this can be simplified into 2. So I have x to the negative fourth over x squared. Now, remember, to rewrite x to the negative fourth as positive, I've got to put it in the denominator. So therefore, I'm going to have 1 over x to the fourth times x squared, which equals 1 over x to the sixth power. And that will be your final answer. <laughs>